Welcome back to VBAR 101. Now I'm going to show you when we connect uh, both power to the VBAR and also uh, connect it up to the PC so we can start working on this thing. First of all, I'm going to hook up my Jive controller uh, to the VBAR. As I said in a previous, uh, the collective becomes the throttle. So I hook up the, my primary throttle cable. The Jive controller has an extra cable to use uh, extra input power. I can put that into any other port because that is free because it's a shared power bus. So I usually put it in auxiliary so I know which one. So now <laughs> the V-bar is actually connected. I'm gonna plug in my USB cable here and uh, we should get the beep from the computer. You actually didn't hear that. So now I'm ready to go. To be able to run the PC program, I need power to the V-bar. Either uh, uh, I can plug in a main pack now if I were to uh, run, uh, if I didn't have anything else, but I usually like to have just a receiver pack because if something should be wrong with the radio programming I wouldn't want the hot spool up here on the bench so any receiver pack and we plug it in and we get power please my I don't mind if the swash plate is off or anything I could have put the servos in the wrong order yet we will determine that now when we have connection and can start the program so that's all for now.